Did the power outlets on your 2019 to 2020 Hyundai Elantra just stop working? Well, don't worry. The problem is very likely just a bad fuse. And in this video, I'm going to show you how to find the bad fuse, how to get the spare fuse, and how to get it working again. So let's go ahead and get started. Open the driver's side door. Now right where the driver's left side foot would go, that's where the primary hood release lever is. Pull it. Now in front of the vehicle, that's where the secondary hood release lever is, right on top of the Honda emblem there. Put one finger in there, push it left, and the hood opens up. Now we need a prop rod over here to secure the hood in place. Get the prop rod out, and we need to insert it in that slot over there with the arrow marking it. Get the prop rod in there, slide it in, let the hood go. It's now secured in place. Once the hood is open, right there, right by the battery, that's where the fuse panel is. We need to get the cover off, so squeeze over there on the two ends and get the cover off. Behind the cover, that's where the fuse diagram is. Let's take a closer look at it. And the way you look at the fuse diagram is you place it right there by the fuse panel. And now we see that on the bottom left corner of the diagram, that's where the fuse puller is. So right there, that's the fuse puller. Nice little plastic tool, very helpful. See how it works? You squeeze it and you put it on the fuse and then you pull the fuse like that. All right, now let's locate the fuse for the power outlets right there. Power outlet three is the one for the driver's side, the left side outlet, and power outlet two is the passenger side, the right side outlet. Those are the fuse right there. The three fuses corresponds with what we see on the diagram. Let's check out the fuse for the driver's side outlet now. And as you see, the power went out in the power adapter. Now once you get the fuse out, you should compare it against the picture you see on the bottom right corner over here. If the metal strip in the middle is broken, then it's a bad fuse. If the metal strip is not broken, then it's a good fuse and then the problem is something else. If the strip is broken, then you can get a spare fuse. Right there, we have a 20 amp spare fuse over there. The green one. We can get that 20 amp spare fuse out and put it in the position where the original fuse went. See what happens when I put it back in. The power comes back on in the power adapter right there. That's good. Same process for the passenger side outlet. 20 amp fuse. Get the fuse out. See what happens. The power is gone in the power adapter there. Same thing. Get the spare fuse. In this case, my fuses are all good. I'm just showing you the process as to how to get the fuses out and how to look at the spare fuses. When I put the fuse back in, the power is back on. Once you're done, don't forget to put the cover back on the fuse panel, like that. In order to close the hood, push the hood up slightly. That will get the load off the prop rod. Get the prop rod out of the slot. Put it back in its place. Lower the hood and slam it shut. That's pretty much it. If you like this video, we got a lot more videos made just for your vehicle. So check out the playlist over there. And if you have a friend or family who can benefit from this video, Please share with them. Till then, drive safe and thank you for watching.